Aloha guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I got this curly hair with just a flat iron. So if you want to see how I did that, then just keep watching. All right, you guys, so I had already started doing my hair um, and in the midst of me learning how to do my curls with a flat iron, I just thought, why don't I film it and show you how I'm doing it. We're kind of learning together, but I'm going to show you what I'm doing. So um, I section my hair because I have thick hair. People with thinner hair, this goes so much faster and you probably don't even have to section your hair. If you have shorter hair, it's even faster and even easier. But I have medium to long, so um, that's what I'm thinking. So that's why I section my hair. So I'm just gonna show you how I've been doing this. It's a little bit, <laughs> I don't think it's as easy as people make it look, but definitely use a heat protectant. Um, I'm using my Kenra hot spray. So yes. All right, so let's, and then I'm taking smaller sections, and then I have my T3 curling iron, my not my curling iron, my flat iron. So you're gonna take it like this, and you're gonna have the mouth open, you're gonna wrap it, and then you're gonna stick the hair in there like that, and then as gently as you possibly can, just Pull, 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 pull. <coughs> My curling iron shut off. Perfect. Okay, so my curling iron for some reason shut off. And it wasn't the curling iron, I think it was the plug shut off. So it was completely cool. Um, in the meantime, I forgot I didn't put on my lips. So I put on my L'Oreal Infallible Paint, um, what are they called? Paints, they're called paints. In the color Spicy Flesh, one of my favorite colors. Anyways, let's get back to it. Okay, so we're gonna go back over this again. I'm gonna show you again. So you're gonna go in back of the hair and it's gonna be open and you're gonna put the hair in like so and then you're just gonna gently 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 pull 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 and I'm just gonna kind of okay that didn't is this on okay let's do it one more time because I don't know what's happening. Everything was fine until my, my flat iron shut off. Okay, again, underneath, and then in between, and then you're just gonna pull, 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 and there we go. And so what I will do is, the video I was watching, they just did that, and that way it gives it a chance to cool that way okay instead of using your wand and say you took a trip and you just wanted to bring one tool and you could bring your flat iron and then you could also curl your hair with your flat iron so here we go and it's harder to do kind of the back pieces but as you can see it is curling I think this is the coolest thing. So one of the things you wanna make sure is you wanna make sure that um, one, you could practice with the flat iron off cause you don't want to damage your hair. You don't want it to get stuck. And two, use a heat protectant definitely. Whoops, I had let go of that. Um, Shoot. Okay, we're gonna have to do that over. <laughs> because I accidentally let you go. And as you can see, I am not a pro at this, 
but I really like how you can curl curl your hair without um, using a wand. So um, if you want to make your suitcase lighter or say you don't want to have all these tools. So I'm going to do this side right here and I'm going to show you how I hold the flat iron. So you're still going to hold it behind the hair and then you're going to you're going to wrap it and then you're going to bring it in between and see how I'm like wiggling it up and then you go down you go kind of slow because you want the heat to get into the hair and there's your curl that's kind of cool I really like it let's let's keep doing it to see if I get good at this I'm curious to see what it's going to be like when I get to the top of my hair so back see that I'll have to move to the side and then wiggle it up and I know there's other ways to to do it but this is the best way that I found to do oh that was a good one to do um, longer hair so there's lots of tutorials on how to curl your hair with a flat iron but what I've noticed is most of the girls that curl their hair with a flat iron have short hair. So again, wiggle it up. And then you don't want to clamp down super hard. And there you go. Yeah, because if you clamp down on the flat iron, no matter how good your flat iron is, um, it's still going to pull your hair. So let's see how I'm going to do this back one. Um, let's see. So go here and then. Yeah, so I'm holding it taut enough where it's able to glide across the hair. Look at that. Um, yeah, but it's not slipping out. Okay, we missed a piece right here. And if you notice, okay, so this is a really thin piece. You'll see how better, like the thinner pieces that you take, the easier it is, or the, the better the hair curls. Look at So. Yeah, so it, it's looking like I've put a wand through my hair, except I'm curling it with my flat iron. So that's pretty cool. So let's put some more heat protectant. I like to make sure I get it good in my hair. That way you're not damaging your hair. Here I'll take smaller pieces. Um, so here, I think it's the more you practice, like the better at it you get. Okay, let's try this front part because I'm curious to see how this is going to do because this is shorter. So again, we're going to put it underneath. Let's just climb up a little bit and whoops. Mm, let's try 
try that one more time. So, I'm gonna close it first and then open it a little bit and then scooch up. And then, okay, that's better. I like that. Okay. Even though I turn on the AC, oh my gosh, whenever I am filming in front of these lights, it gets so hot. All right, so we're almost done. I'll do this last one with you guys and then I'll finish up off camera and then I'll show you the finished product. Okay, so it's all finished, all curled. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna separate the curls. Um, yeah, and this is what I normally do even when I use the curling wand. So I just separate these babies. And then I go in and like if I wanted something recurled, then I do that at that time. Let's see. wanted to go up higher but I don't think it'll go up higher so let's just spray that and then I feel like this could use a extra zhuzh So I think really like with this is like practice because I feel like by the time I was done um, doing my whole hair um, I was getting pretty good at it so yeah <sighs> all right next to spray so we can keep this hair for a couple days and not have to curl it. I don't know guys, what do you think? Do you guys like curling with a flat iron? Again, I use my T3, which I bought at Costco um, for a song and a dance. But so how, do you, how did you guys like this? Thumbs up, thumbs down, what did you think? Have you ever curled your hair with a flat iron? Like for me, I've tried before, but never have I done my whole head. And um, I really like it, I think it's really cool. Um, so yeah, that is the end of this video, guys. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Um, if you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button and then hit that bell button as well so you'll be notified whenever I upload a video. Otherwise, I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.